feeling of match day and the desire to lose yourself in the moment. That's what today is all about. A meeting of two talented sides ready to go at it in front of a capacity crowd. Not to mention the eyes of the wider football world. Stay tuned to find out live here on EA TV. Hello from Catalonia. This is the scene here at this intimate venue, the Estadio de Montelivi. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It is Girona up against Real Betis. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the Girona starting 11. David Lopez plays alongside Daly Blint in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Did well to clear it away. Well, for Girona, you have to say it was a good performance and result in the last match against Athletic Bilbao. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, what a performance that was away from home. It doesn't get better than that. Today, we'll follow a similar pattern, and I expect them to win by the odd goal. Firing it towards goal. Just couldn't get it through. Well, the numbers really speak for themselves. Um, the home side boasting the best defensive record in the league. They're going to be very hard to break down, you just feel. Well, they've been so well organised defensively. They press the ball from the front, the midfield players work really hard, and the defence are so disciplined. They're just so hard to break down. Really good build-up, but no end product. And that is the sort of tackle he had scripted in his mind. William Carvalho. Pedzela. It's with William Carvalho. Now with Avila. Now look at this. They might be able to cash in here. A fine reading of the situation. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Viktor Tsigankov. Well, Betis have it back now. Well, a really good run. Big chance! He can't hold on to it. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. And it's with Rodriguez. Ezequiel Avila. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And take it away. Perez. And he's hit it with authority. Oh, fine stop. They fancy a short one. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Carman Pedzela. And return to Fekir. Still level here. 
but the pressure escalating. Well, trying to take the time, but not enough care on the ball. Ivan Martin. On to Iglesias. Promising attack, this. Well read to ease the pressure. Nabil Fekir. Quatra has it. William Carvalho. Nabil Fekir. William Carvalho. Perez. And Betis did well to regain possession. And a relatively straightforward save for the keeper. Sigankov. Viktor Sigankov. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? And quick thinking defensively. That's very effective. Good high pressing. He must finish! Well, plenty of power there, but in fairness, should have made the keeper work. Fekir read it superbly to take back possession. Rodriguez well the defenders know they need to get tighter can't really allow runs like that well it wasn't a great header in all fairness and a goal kick it is Garcia Viktor Tsigankov He's in with a chance Well that's a really top-notch piece of defending A Jose Perez On to Avila Going well Fekir Can he give them the lead? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. And the counter looks on here. Options available. And intercepted it. William Carvalho. Oh, great attacking play. Fekia cutting it back and keeping it out. An example of a goalkeeper in top form here. Ivan Martin. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the card. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. And the referee brings this first half to an end. It's now in the history books here in Catalonia.
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. A Jose Perez. William Carvalho. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Trying to really get at the opposition here. A glorious chance. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And from there, he never looked like this. That's a lovely goal. Knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? So the ball rolling again, 2 0. A Jose Perez. It's with William Carvalho. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Fekia, spot on with that tackle. An exciting La Liga match in prospect here on EA TV. It's Girona against Atletico. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Ezequiel Avila. That's with William Carvalho. Been a good challenge. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Fekir. Oh, good vision. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep it quiet. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Three goals without reply. Nabil Fekir. It's with William Carvalho. Pedzela. William Carvalho. And it's with Rodriguez. Nabil Fekir. They couldn't maintain possession. Now we're into the final half hour. And a strong tackle. Doing everything possible to keep possession. And a throw coming up after that authoritative challenge. Yangel Herrera. Solis. Valeri. William Carvalho. In possession, Fekir. Ezekiel Avila. Yusuf Sabali with it. And return to Fekir. And it's with Rodriguez. No way through. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. 
Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Artem Dovbik. And he saw the situation developing. Really getting stuck in. Zigankov. Dovbik. He's beaten his man. Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Ezekiel Avila. Now with Iglesias. And he has options available. The delivery. And putting pay to the danger. Fakir! And there's a quality defender in action. Oh, a smart stop. Short corner it is. Textbook defending inside the box. Decisive in the tackle and a throw in here. Both substitutes have been getting ready, will come on at the same time. Solis, that's a good pass, just needs to stay calm. And a goal! He's put it away! A celebratory mark! Here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Herman Petzela. Fakir. And it's with Rodriguez. Slipshod passing. So almost at full time, and the home side very much in command. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. Now will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Ibrahim Akebe. Christian Stuani. Being egged on by the crowd. Keeper did his job to begin with. Danger averted for now. Hector Bellerin. Good example of pressing without the ball. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. And we are going to have two additional minutes. work to regain possession 
Well, they have the advantage. That's good refereeing. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, they've been great defensively, as we know, but it was all about their front players today. Their movement, awareness of space, and speed of thought was just too much for their opponents. They could have won this by a lot more.